Have you ever heard of a procedure nicknamed the heart drill? It sounds scary, but it's actually a precise, minimally invasive treatment called rotational atherectomy. Many people develop blockages in their heart arteries because of calcified plaque, hard deposits that build up on the artery walls. Think of it like lime scale in a pipe. Regular balloons or stents just can't get through. That's when doctors bring in a special tool called a rotablator. It's a thin catheter inserted through a blood vessel, usually from the wrist or groin, guided up to the heart. At its tip is a high-speed rotating burr coated with tiny diamond chips. It spins at about 160,000 revolutions per minute, gently grinding away the hardened plaque into particles smaller than red blood cells, which are safely carried away by the bloodstream. This smooths the artery's inner wall, making it easier for balloon angioplasty and stent placement to open it fully. The procedure is done under local anesthesia, with minimal incisions and quick recovery, often restoring healthy blood flow for patients with complex heart disease. Still, it's not right for everyone. Before considering rotational atherectomy, talk with your cardiologist, review your condition and risks, and decide together if it's the best option for you.